Good morning. Hope you're doing well on this Monday morning as you start off a new week. This is David Richard. I will bounce and try body, mind, and spirit. So, got one to share, little idea to share with you today that I had learned yesterday. I should say, shouldn't say learn how to remember it. So, we're at Monday morning right now, so probably sometime Friday it started and kind of compounded over the weekend, which was... Uh, Getting different emails, uh, reading some messages, getting different things in, getting in my own head, and basically the feelings all start to compound each other. I mean, with some of the stuff I was reading, some of the stuff I'm reading about, and somebody's got conflicting information, they go back and forth, uh, dealing with um, worry, doubt, anxiety, probably a little f fear in there as well. Then I started thinking my own head, started getting some other issues going on, for lack of a better term, I say loneliness. And the idea is all these emotions started piling up. And I was letting them do this, and it just kept compounding, compounding, more information's coming up Friday, Saturday, Sunday night, and <clears throat> just was really bothering me, really kind of getting me down. It wasn't until late last night, no, later last night, I was having my decaf coffee, playing a game on my computer, and suddenly I was, the aha moment, it was a reminder for me, so I go, oh, brother, duh, <clears throat> which I'll come to that in a moment. <clears throat> But after that, probably about an hour, I was getting ready for my shower. I was able to kind of process a little bit because sometimes I'm thinking about, okay, how can I utilize this? How can I share this information up? And I was realizing all the emotions I was feeling were what you can kind of consider, quote unquote, negative or low vibration. I'm not going to call them negative or bad because all emotions have a purpose. They don't come up for no reason. There's usually a message to give you. <clears throat> and I was able to process there and think about, okay, what was I feeling? Okay, doubt worry, fear, loneliness. I don't want to say hatred, because that was quite there, but strong dislike, uh, scared, and all these different emotions. Like I had to realize and go, oh, those are all low vibration energies, which bring me down, don't do you don't do much good. But what got me that <clears throat> is the aha moment that I had to remember. And I've shared this up before. And that is, it's in there, I'm drinking my coffee, decaf at night and playing the game suddenly it's like I'm feeling all these emotions kind of going through my head and it's like ah emotions only last 90 seconds if they last longer than that which some of you can say hey yeah I've lasted for several days maybe several years maybe several decades it's because of the story you've attached to them something comes up we attach a thought to it which <coughs> excuse me a story what happens is we'll keep telling that story to ourselves over and over and over again. And that's what keeps those emotions going. And that's what I realized for myself. I was going through, and I kept bringing up these different scenarios. I was telling my story about, okay, I read this article here. I've seen this one here. This person said this, that person said that. And I was reading all these stories to them. And literally, as soon as that notion came to me, it's like, ah, emotions only last 90 seconds on the story. It was like a physical weight was lifted off me. I felt instantly better. And then, which allowed me to then process a little more, saying, okay, these were negative emotions. I was negative emotions. They were low vibration. What triggered them? What caused them? I was able to process it all. Now, there definitely are techniques that you can use to process to go things deeper. <clears throat> Not time for that, and I didn't have to use them. But the simple notion was, yeah, emotions only last 90 seconds. Anything longer than that, there's stories we attach to them. So it took me three days. Because again, this started like Friday, either Friday morning, Friday afternoon. I didn't get this till Sunday night is when this moment finally got to me. And again, when I realized that, it clicked for me. A physical weight was lifted off me, and I just felt instantly better. And everything just kind of dropped away. So there's a little tip for you <clears throat> that you can kind of go through. Is if you're getting overwhelmed, realize, ride the emotions out. Sit with them. Go through them. And realize... If they last longer than 90 seconds, it's because of the story you've attached to them that you keep telling yourself on repeat over and over again. Reminder for me, it's something I tell my clients. So, I'm not perfect. I still make things up. I still goof up. I still trip up and make many mistakes. <clears throat> and hopefully, I learn from them. So, next time this comes around, which I'm sure there, there's most likely definitely going to be another next time this happens, I'll be able to catch it sooner. So enjoy the rest of your day, use the information, and share your thoughts with me on that, if you would, please. Take care and bounce it to you. Bye-bye.